Hello, my name is Kareem Abulnag and I'm the CEO of Practice Makes Perfect. Um, I'm here today with my colleague to give you as parents a little bit of an insight as to what your kids will be doing with us for the summer. But before we jump into it, we wanted to give you a little bit of background on who we are. Um, I actually grew up in Long Island City, Queens, was raised by a single parent on government aid, and as a result of where I grew up, I went through some of New York City's most struggling public schools. In fact, my high school only had a 55% graduation rate and only 20% of the kids that were college ready. Fortunately for me, I had a series of nonprofits and mentors step into my life that made a big difference. And recently, I graduated in the top 10% of my class from Cornell University, and I've been working on Practice Makes Perfect as an avenue to pay it forward. Hi, my name is Brandon Espinosa, CEO of Practice Makes Perfect. Similar to Kareem, I grew up in the Bronx and went through the inner city public school system. I had a series of influential mentors in my life who really have led and guided me to where I am today. As a first generation college graduate of Cornell University in May of 2011, I decided to join forces with Kareem to take this agenda of educational equity and serve kids all across New York City and the country. So Brandon, if I'm a parent, I'm probably wondering, what is Practice Makes Perfect? So, did you know that in our communities, kids are being robbed of half of their education year in and year out? You must be wondering, how can this be? So, over the summer, kids forget anywhere from two and a half to three and a half months of what they learn. And a teacher needs to spend six to eight weeks reteaching. So, when you do the math, an aggregate is five months that they're being robbed of. So how do we expect them to compete intellectually in our society? Practice Makes Perfect has developed a six-week summer enrichment program where we bring back kids in our communities and put them under the supervision of college interns and certified teachers, as well as mentors who are four years older and live in those same communities and are high achieving. So what are the basic pillars of our program? Well, simple, academic excellence, near-peer mentorship, cultural learning, and serving our Street Saturdays, which is the community service component of our program. So, Kareem, as a parent, what does my child go through every day? Yes, yeah, so the typical day actually starts at 8 a.m. for the mentors, but for your kids it starts at 9. We provide breakfast and lunch through the school food program. The, both the kids and the mentors are there from 9 to 4. Um, at 4 o'clock your kid is dismissed, and the mentors then stick around for one more hour of instruction on high school readiness and college readiness. But throughout the day, your child can expect an hour of reading, an hour of writing, and an hour of math. Each of those lessons are really focused on actual doing, where they're working in their small groups with their mentors. They also take spelling tests and vocabulary tests, which eventually build up to a huge spelling bee midway through the summer. They have an hour for gym. We want to make sure that our kids are physically active, and 45 minutes for lunch. They also are assigned a book that they read together as a class in their smaller groups. Um, and then over the course of the summer, you'll see that your kids are also working on one big enrichment project. Um, and as we get to the end of the summer, they'll actually have formal presentations that we hope to invite you to. And then also throughout the summer, all of the kids are going on a minimum of three field trips. Um, they can be to local museums, colleges or universities, or even to the local park with their instructors. So what should I be doing and how can I get involved? Yeah, as a parent, um, we're working on our parent engagement strategies. We're going to have workshops for you all every single Wednesday um, from 8 a.m. to 9 a.m. and from 4 p.m. to 5 p.m. So that way you can make it um, fit into your schedule. We're also going to have our service projects. As Brandon mentioned earlier, service learning is a really big part of what we do. Every single Saturday we have our kids doing community service, which you all are more than welcome to join us in. The last part is that we're going to have an open house halfway through the summer, and we hope to have you guys there to see the work that your kids are doing and to also celebrate the teachers in the neighborhood who are helping make sure that they're there and active over the summer. And then the last piece actually um, revolves around what you can do at home. Your kids are going to be assigned some spelling words and some vocabulary words, and we really want to make sure that when they get to school the next day that they're ready to ace those quizzes, because it will help build their self-esteem and confidence. So Practice Makes Perfect is a six-week summer enrichment program for your children to get involved, stay active, and academically challenge them over the summer so that we're eliminating the summer learning loss that plagues our communities. It's a community-centric model and it's a holistic model, and we hope that you can join forces with the Practice Makes Perfect team to really eliminate the summer learning loss and bring educational equity to our communities. 
To learn more about our program, you can visit us at www.practicemakesperfect.org or you can email us at info, I-N-F-O, at practicemakesperfect.org. Thank you for your time, and we look forward to serving your children this summer.